welcome to Palmer Update TV, the world's first and only TV network with a free petrochemicals news show. It is Wednesday, April 15th. I am Tejal Hode. Our special news of today is sponsored by Delhi-based new blast machinery. Let's start with energy and feed stock news. Oil prices plunged on Tuesday following API's report indicating a sharp surge in the crude oil inventory. Also, dampening oil demand due to the pandemic overshadowed the oil production cuts approved by the OPEC over the weekend. Brent futures declined sharply by $2.14, settling at $29.60 per barrel, while WTI futures plummeted by $2.30, settling at $20.11 per barrel. According to Vandana Hari of Anja Insights, Brent and WTI futures were creeping higher early Wednesday in Asia. Amid some bargain hunting buying after sliding by 7% and 10% respectively in Tuesday's session. Open spec NAFTA prices rose by 3 US dollars per metric ton to the 180 US dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. Despite bearish upstream crude values, propylene prices boasted higher in Asia on Monday. The steep price rise was on the back of bullish buying sentiments in key markets like China. Moving on to the Asian market update for PP, PE, and PVC. In PP, this week PP prices spiked in the Far East and Southeast Asian regions. The steep price rise was triggered by bullish demand trends in key markets like China and higher import offers from the overseas suppliers. Stronger upstream propylene values further supported the price gain. In HDP, HDP prices marched higher in the Far East and Southeast Asian regions this week. The price rise was attributed to stronger import offers from the overseas producers coupled with bullish buying trends in major markets like China. In PVC, PVC prices slipped in Asia this week. Prices fell as demand trends continued to remain bearish across the Asian regions. A tumble in upstream ethylene rates further pressured prices lower. For detailed price assessments of PPP and PVC, we invite you to subscribe to Palmer Update. Our weekly benchmark price assessment and analysis are available on our website for all our subscribers to benefit from. Our special news of the day is sponsored by Delhi-based New Plus Machinery. Established in the year 2009, New Plus Machinery is a manufacturer, exporter and supplier of filler master batch machines, dispersion leader machines, palletizing lines, plastic extruder machines, etc. That's all for today's Palmer News. Watch our daily news video tomorrow to know more. It is Wednesday, April 15th. I am Tejal Hore. Thank you. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash Palmer Update and be sure to click the like button. You can also find us on Twitter at Palmer Update. For the latest news from the plastics and petrochemicals industry, subscribe to our YouTube channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon.